Hey guys, I wanted to do another video today on like I did. I just didn't want my pregnant on my 20 weeks pregnancy, but I'm gonna do another one right now about how it is to be 19, married, and living on my own. You know, um, with people just looking at you and judging you just by the way you look. I mean, my husband and I, we've been married, uh, we've been married, it's already going to be two years in September, the, the month when the baby's born, it's going to be two years, um, we, we've been together, we've been happy, you know, um, my mom doesn't live nearby, she lives 12 hours away, and his parents, his family lives seven hours away, so, I mean, I'm not going to school because... I had some trouble with school and then I was going to go back in August and uh, I had some problems with my financial aid and then I got pregnant and then I just, I, now I'm going to have to wait till next year to, so I can get used to being a new, uh, newborn's mom. Um, it's, it is tough, I would say, because it wasn't expected, I mean, I, love my baby but it we we weren't expecting to get pregnant so young we we were gonna wait i mean my husband's almost done with school and he's still needs to go to law school and he's um i mean he's he's very good to me i guess i grew up in a town where all the girls i mean well i'm not even gonna say a town because it's all over the america now where all these teens getting pregnant at 15, 16, and it's like, I don't want to be categorized into that because I'm 19, I've been married, so it's like, she, my, my baby, she's not going to be out of wedlock, you know, she's, has a loving home, we have our own apartment, and I say our own because it was his parents' gift, they bought us a condo, um, and he has his own car. It's not like we, when we were not struggling, I would say as much as other people, um, because we have it better than a lot of people. But yet, the fact that some people just are so quick to judge and um, give you that, you know, that that oh, you're pregnant. Like, aren't you like? Didn't you just graduate from high school? Like, what are you gonna do for your life? Go to college, you know, get a job, do all this crap. It's like. It makes me feel so less, you know? I mean, not everything can be prevented. And, well, I mean, a lot of stuff can, but not everything. And I just want to give out my opinion on how I feel about that because it's it's hard, you know? It's it's hard when, when we would just look at you and be like, oh, uh, aren't you like 17? No, I'm not. I'm 19. I'm almost going to be 20 in a couple of months, you know? And my husband's already going to be 21. He, we're not, like, I know we're still young. I know we're still kids having kids, but we're not babies having babies. If, if that, I don't know if that makes any sense. But I just want to give all my opinion because it makes me angry. It makes me angry when people say stuff like that. It's like, you guys don't understand. You how how hard it is you know to be on your own already going to college and then having a, having a baby it is hard and but I just don't want to be judged you know I don't know if that makes any sense uh, I just don't want anybody to look at me ugly and say stuff I mean I don't know if I'm wrong or if I'm right or if I should be or if I deserve to but it, it hurts. It hurts people's feelings, you know? And I guess a lot of the girls out there are going to say my generation. I already have, I know, I, I know girls from school who already have two kids and they're like three, you know? I, I don't know. I mean, I have a plan, so I think that's all that matters. So I just don't want to be judged because I'm already having it hard as it is, you know, having to do all this, 
budgeting and planning and baby by myself with no family to help, you know, I've already have to put up with that and this little dog right here, this little brat. So, uh, also, I did it in my other videos, in my video, I'm, I told you guys I'm going to have a girl, but I don't have a name for her and I would love if you guys can help me choose a name for my baby girl because I only had a boy's name. So I thought I was only going to have a boy, and now I don't know what I'm going to have. So if you guys could please help me, it would be wonderful. And I guess I will let you guys go. And then thanks for listening to this. Y'all let me know how you guys feel and your opinions. I would love to hear from somebody else's um, side. Say bye, Hershey. Bye. Say bye. Say bye over there. <laughs> Bye guys.